Hello, Michael. How are you today? I am fine. What's up? Jessica. I was looking over the 500 statistical tests you ran, and I saw there are three that had p-values of smaller than 0.05. I am so excited we have findings. I am sorry, Jessica, but those findings may not be considered significant, given all the tests that were run. Huh? You see, when you run many tests, you increase the chance of making a type 1 error. What are you talking about? P smaller than 0 0.05. Yes, but those P values are unadjusted for the number of tests run. I don't care, the P is smaller than 0 0.05. Yes, but in actually, it isn't. Once you account for all of the tests, the P value is much larger. I don't care, the P value in the output you gave me is smaller than 0 0.05. But it isn't. If just one test was performed at the 0 .05 level, then there is only a 5% chance of incorrectly rejecting the null hypothesis if the null hypothesis is true. However, for 500 tests where all null hypotheses are false, the expected number of incorrect rejections is 25. If the tests are independent, the probability of at least one incorrect rejection is 99.4%. I don't understand. For example, one might declare that a coin was biased if in 10 flips it landed heads at least 9 times. Indeed, if one assumes as a null hypothesis that the coin is fair, then the probability that a fair coin would come up heads at least 9 out of 10 times is 1.1%. Now, imagine if one was to test 100 fair coins by this method. The most coins would not have this many heads there is a strong chance that one of them will be heads at least 9 out of 10 times. In actuality, there would only be a 34% chance that all 100 fair coins would be identified as fair, which is indeed the case. I don't understand what you are saying. Who cares how many tests I have done? I see P smaller than 0 0.05. This is significant. Jessica. I think you are not listening to what I am saying. The family-wise p-value is larger than the observed p-value and needs to be adjusted. I am hungry. Do you have any food? That bag of Doritos look mighty yummy. Are you going to eat though? S Please go away.